Former President Trump was a guest on the Hugh Hewitt radio show, and here's the question he was asked. My question to you, Mr. President, if you're not the nominee, will you support whoever the GOP nominee is? It would depend. I would, I would give you the same answer I gave in 2016 during the debate. The first question I was asked by Brett Baer. I was asked two rather, I was asked two rather interesting questions. Uh, it would have to depend on who the nominee was. And joining us now to discuss host of Dick Morris Democracy and advisor to Presidents Clinton and Trump, the one and only Dick Morris. Uh, Dick, great to have you with us on this Friday afternoon. Uh, your reaction to President Trump's response there, uh, it was, it was uh, you know, hedging his bets. But my guess is, I don't know that he would, would, do you think he would support someone else if he isn't the nominee? Listen, for God's sakes, when you're 13 points ahead in a two-way race and you're 11 points of ahead in the field of 20 other candidates, you shouldn't have to answer, what'll you do if you lose? Yeah, I mean, come on. Uh, if you're losing or it's a tie race or something, okay. But that's just a set-up question that they fed to him because they know his answer isn't going to be blind acceptance because it never is. That's why people like Donald Trump. And it's baloney. Uh, he's so far ahead in the field. Ask them if they'll support Donald Trump if he's elected. But could I comment just briefly on your previous guest who talked about Newsmax and DirecTV? Please do, He Dick. made a brilliant point. He made a brilliant point that, that Newsmax, he basically differentiated Newsmax from Fox. And you ask yourself, if Newsmax is banned, why isn't Fox? They're both conservative. And the answer to that is there's one difference between Newsmax and Fox. And that's because of the w w Murdoch who owns Fox. They will not put Donald Trump on the air. They will not show his debates. They will not show his speeches. They will not show his rallies. And Newsmax will. And that's the only difference. And I suspect that the reason that Fox does not cover them is because it's afraid of being banned. And what this is, is an attempt to ban Donald Trump. Forget about Newsmax. This is an attempt to silence and ban Donald Trump. And we can't accept it. Those of you who subscribe to DirecTV cannot let them censor you in this way. You have to call 1-877-NEWSMAX, N-E-W-S-M-A-X, and demand that DirecTV cover the Trump stuff that it keep put Newsmax back on the air or pull the plug on them by cutting off your direct TV and your cell phone service. Let's, they dress this up as a business decision. That's mm -hmm. nonsense. And by the way, the conservatives say it's an ideological decision. That's nonsense, too. It's an anti-Trump decision. If we're ideological, they'd ban Fox News, too. This is a deliberate hit to keep Donald Trump from the presidency, and we can't allow that to stand. All right, Dick Morris, passionate as always. Really appreciate your being with us. Thank you. Thank you.